Welcome to DIY Yolandi. I hope you enjoy this video. Please click that like button because today we are turning this to this. You will need your desired colors, cups for the number of colors you'll be using, and your canvases. First step is you'll have to mask the area that you do not want painted. For more details on what a masking tape does, check out this post on my Instagram. Step two, mix your paint accordingly. You'll need your paint and water, your cup and a stirring stick. I used acrylic paint. I wanted the consistency to be more liquidy. <laughs> Wait, is that even a word? <laughs> yeah, see, I should have demonstrated with black paint because you can't see the white paint. Step three, blop the paint on the canvas in whatever sequence you prefer. I started with white so that it creates a more appealing base. So the paint was not moving as I wanted, so I added more water and did this to mix the paint together and it now moves well. <laughs> I legit bought this hair dryer for my DIY projects and not for my hair because I do not use heat on my hair. Uh, it's safe to say though that it did not serve a purpose in this DIY project. So let me put that aside. Remember to spread your base paint evenly on your canvas. Step four, add your second color and move the liquid paint as shown. See, this starts creating the beautiful marble effect. Step five, repeat step four and continue adding your paint colors. When you're done, leave out to dry in a sheltered space for at least 48 hours to be safe. Because since the paint is sitting on top of each other, it may take longer than normal to dry. So the second canvas was done off camera. And here is the final product. Thank you so much for getting this far in this video. Please don't forget to hit that like button and comment down below what did you learn in this DIY. To stay connected with me throughout the week when I'm not posting on YouTube, follow your girl on Instagram at Yolandi underscore See you next time. Peace.